to turn pro have to have a policy about Pokemon. What's your approach when you catch Pokemon? A policy is an all-out offensive aquatic type Pokemon. Yeah, well, I have an I used to have a mono grass team. Alright, and she's wearing a bikini go figure. Alright, she starts off with a star you, that's a level 18 uh, water type. Pure water type, with the moves tackle and water gun. Honestly, if you have trouble with this, you are in for a long, long battle. Hey, at least it doesn't have recover. Alright, Starmie. This is her other Pokemon. And this one's actually strong. It is a level 21 water psychic type. With the moves tackle, water gun, harden, and a bubble beam. What's whatever her point is by using two water moves on this thing is beyond me. Do 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 Yeah, if you have Charmander, you might want to get an Oddish or a Bellsprout just as a rental. And it goes down to trouble, level 23, huzzah. And we have defeated Misty. Wow, you too much. Alright, you can have the Cascade Badge to show you beat me. 20, 79. Excel Pokemon up to level 30 obey, including even outsiders. You know, you just cut out a battle. And now we can get Bubble Beam. I personally like Bubble Beam a lot more than um, what you get in Fire Red Leaf Green, which is Water Pulse, because Bubble Beam has more power. And we're going to teach that to who else? Mew. You know why? Because it's Mew. Anywho, I'm going to cut to Veridi or Vermillion, where we were before in the last part. When I fit. Alright, let's continue on on this route. Who's there? Quit listening in on us. Can somebody please tell that to my math teacher? He's always creeping on people. It's a camper. Squirtle, there is your third of the three starters. Uh, yeah, Squirtle, really, it's not much. Level 20, though, that's actually kind of strong. Be wary if you have a Charmander. Because this thing could probably kill you if it had the chance. Alright. 14, wow, gaining levels really quickly. Junior Trainer Mail was killed. I just can't win. Winning. Excuse me, this is a private conversation. He was looking the other way, you doofus. I mean, sluts nowadays. Stupid sluts these days. Alright, a Rattata. Alright, King, you use Bubble Beam because your special is a little higher than your physical attack. Well, guess what? Take another bubble beam to the face, fool! Alright, and a Pikachu! Oh, boy. The mascot of Pokemon. Dang. Ah, oh, ear rape. Let's put Pikachu where it belongs. Dead. Fifteen. Game. Do you want to be any cooler? Jeez. It is kind of new to be having a legendary. I will admit that. But, the thing is so darn good, and there's such a limited amount of Pokemon in this game, that, you know, I have permission. Alright, now this guy is cool because he has a Butterfree. Uh, bubble beam. That 
did not do a whole lot. Ah, uh, you suck. You know, we need brute force out there. Okay, go Bufflin. Go Bufflin. Oh, fan freaking fantastic This could... Oh! Parafusion. It's a cheap tactic. Do not die. Good. And now... Oh, you've got to be freaking kidding me. Well, there's our first death of the game. Bufflin pinches again. And it costs us again. Finish him. Another crit would be nice. Oh, nice amount of experience, a nice level up. And this Mew is already awesome. Now you're pretty much forced to fight these two, so we'll just get them out of the way. Okay, I'll play. Okay. Do do. Pidgey. Finish him! Er, finish her! Pidgey, of course. The thing about Transform is you also copy their stats, which sucks because Mew has such kick awesome stats. Imagine transforming into a Ditto. So you transform into what the Ditto transformed into, which would be another Ditto, so it'd be an infinite loop of transforms. Level 17. Pidgey. No, why you no die? Why you no dead, Pidgey? Finish her.
This here is Diglett's Cave. It goes all the way back to near Viridian. It's a great place to train on. So if you have something weak that needs to be trained up, and it's not electric type, preferably a water or a grass type, bring them here into Diglett's Cave. Have them feast on the weak Diglett. They can hit hard, and they're criminally fast. And occasionally, you'll run into dug trios, which are ridiculously rare and pretty tough to kill. GTFO. There's no arena trap in this game, thankfully. So yeah, let's see if we can find a dug trio while we're here. I remember, um, when Tenjin Moop was in here training Squirtle in yellow, he was, like, lecturing on, like, the Diglett thing. I got a dumb trio the first time. It was so funny. Do, 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 do. What? That's it? I do not remember being this short. It's a rock tunnel, but it's dark and scary. Pokemon Splash could light it off. Anywho. Can't go through here yet, because we don't have cut. Obviously. Abra for Mr. Mime. That is a rip-off in your favor. Mr. Mime is so underrated. It doesn't have a lot of HP. It's special and speed are really high. And the fact that it's a psychic type just adds to its successes, and the fact that it can set up screens. So, yeah. That's there if you're interested. I'm gonna cut back to Vermilion, unless I find a dev trio, in which case I'll come back. Alright, here on the dock. I went and healed, by the way. Get out of the way. Do, do. Excuse me, do you have a ticket? Flash the SS ticket. Welcome to the SSN. Now, if you manage to die while you're on board before it leaves, you can come back and you can use Surf. There's a truck over there. There used to be a rumor that Mew was underneath it, but it wasn't. I don't know why the truck is there. It's even there in Fire Red Leaf Green. Aw, so sad. How about now, you crazy old man? This bus, they're bus. <laughs> wow, I just said, I just called this a bus. Wow, we're patented nest mental fail. Um, it's mostly full of gentlemen who are really rich and give you a lot of monies. Critical, that probably didn't matter at all, but it's nice to have. But to use another freaking Growlithe. Dig. Smash to the face. 19, dang. I've really made progress on this thing since the part started. My, my friends, no, you killed my friends. Okay, I gotta stop mocking this guy. You pop! How dare you barge in! You dare come to my lair? You no, you dare bring light to my lair? You must die! Once again, I am the internet meme guy, and the internet mail is nothing. Dig. Dig it like you've never dug before. Oh, dug. Oh my god, that theme was so catchy and it used to always piss me off. The show was good though. The show was pretty good. But it was it was it was weird. I miss 90s cartoons, those were good. Like the good SpongeBob, Rub Your Ads, Doug. It's like you look at Nickelodeon right now, half of them are like DreamWorks movies, like remastered. 
or wait, not DreamWorks, uh, I don't know. Peter, I would like a cherry pie, please. Oh, you have made me hungry. For pie. What do you have to say? Let's travel with Wiggly Duff. Cruise is so elegant yet cozy. Oh my god, snobby rich people. Bonjour, I am Le Waiter on the ship. I will be happy to serve you anything you please. Ah, Le Strong Silent Type. Ah, I suck it. Oh my pork! <laughs> I love Pokemon. Well, duh. I, if I didn't like Pokemon, I wouldn't be playing this game. Freaking moron. Another Ninoran male. We all don't know what to do. Dig. Smash. Twenty. Trying to learn Mega Punch. That is why I didn't use the TM. Get rid of Pound. That reminds me, Nido King is close to learning uh, Thrash. Anywho, I'm gonna end this part off here. The next part, we're gonna listen to even more snobby rich people. And we're gonna end this part off with getting TM away, which is a move I will check out. I believe this is the Horn Drill TM. No, it's not. It's Body Slam. You know, I'll just think on the next part. Okay, bye.